All right, guys, we're hooked up already. I ain't even got to do an intro yet. I guess I'll do it while we're reeling in this fish. Uh, I'm Paul, this is 828 Catfishing. We're down here on Lake Norman this morning. It is springtime, baby, finally. Water temp is 60 degrees right now. I am fishing extremely shallow. I mean, we're talking a foot or two is what this fish just come out of. But yeah, guys, that right there come off a chunk of brim. Let me get them in the boat and I'll show them to you and do a little bit formal more intro. Quit. I ain't a bad fish, guys. Well, you'd open your mouth. At least I got my bait back on that one. Yeah, guys, there he is. It might still be a little dark. I was afraid it's still too dark to do an intro. That's why I hadn't started yet, but the fish is going to start it for us. So let's get this one back in like we always do, and I'll tell you what we're doing. Oh, that fish got the last life. He just put face full of water. But yeah, guys, we're down here on Lake Norman. I'm fishing on a point. I mean, the bank ain't 30 yards behind the camera here. And we are, one of them rods right there may have just got hit. But uh, we've got shad and perch and all kinds of stuff just all flopping everywhere around us here, so. Hopefully we're in for a good day. I did bring planter board, so if the anchor bite don't pan out, we are gonna start dragging. I couldn't fish yesterday. We had 60 mile an hour winds all day yesterday. At times, gust, sustained 40. But uh, we're after them today, so stick around. Let's see what we can get into. All right, guys, we're hooked up again already. Now this one right here don't feel like a bad fish. And I had this one throwed up towards the bank over here. We might have us a good day today. We might not have to pull out the planter board. I don't think he's that big. I think he just had a lot of fight at first. Running down the bank there. Yeah, he ain't that big. That's actually a daggum channel cat. But hey, we'll take it. Them eight alt team catfish double action doing their jobs. I switched hooks. I've been having a lot of problems out of them mustads here lately. I don't know what's going on. They've always been reliable hooks, but here lately they've been bending and I just ain't been getting hook up, so I'm trying a new hook. So far, so good. But, uh, there he is guys, fish number two in the boat already. That was quick, that was back to back. That was almost a double. That's a nice little channel cat right there. Let's do like we always do though. Oh, guys look right there.
We're on them. We're hooked up again. I've got brim and I've got creek chubs. So far, that first one come off the brim, that second one come off the creek chub, and I don't know, I can't remember what's on this one. Now guys, that ain't a bad blue. That's a little bit better quality right there. I'm running out of room. I've got too many rods laying here. guys that and stole the bait so i don't know i'm pretty sure that was a creek chub though so i think it's two two to one now it's a little bit better blue right there though guys but yeah that's three fish now within about seven eight minutes so let's get this one back and let's get baited back out throw it back out and let's see if we can't keep it going He gone. All right, guys, we're hooked up again. I couldn't get to the camera in time. I about to got this one in. There he is guys, fish number four in about 15 minutes. We're on a roll this morning. Yeah, I thought the camera was on and I turned it off. I couldn't get to it, but it's all right. You are seeing it. And I apologize for that sun. There ain't nothing I can do about that right now. But yeah guys, let's do like we always do. Let's let him go. He gone. All right, guys, we're hooked up again. Oh, my God. Guys, I think that was a flathead. Oh well, you win some, you lose some. Let's bait it up and get it back out. All right, guys, we're hooked up again. This one started peeling drag.
nice blue kit. Ain't a bad one right there. Let's do like we always do. Let go. Let. He gone. I think that was fish number five or six. I need to get me one of them little clicking doodads to keep up with them. But so far it's been a pretty good morning. I got my bait back on that so I'm gonna throw it back out. See there, guys. Old Creek Tub's getting it done. Let's get it back out. All right, guys, we're hooked up again. This is off that rod throwed up on the bank and I think I missed that flathead on earlier. If it wasn't a flathead, it is a really good fish. This one don't feel too bad of a fish. I don't think he ain't no pig, but he might be a flathead. He's digging. Nope, he's a blue cat. You'd open your mouth. But, like always, he ain't going to. Boy, that hook stuck him now. I can't. There we go. Well, guys, there's fish number six, I think. Another nice blue kit. It ain't as active as it was first thing this morning, but 
At least we're still getting a few. Let's do like we always do though. Let's let him go. He gone. All right, guys, let me get that rod baited up, thrown back towards the bank here. Let's see if we can get another. I'm probably going to give this spot till about 9 o'clock. It's 8.30 right now. We don't get something better quality or bigger. I think I'm going to start dragging for a little bit. So... Get baited back up, cast out, and see what we can get. Stick around. All right, guys, we're hooked up again. I didn't even get that other rod baited up yet. This is not a very big fish, I don't think. Nope, well. It's about what we've been getting, blue cat. We've got our money's worth on that piece of brim. It's like second or third fish now. Well, there he is, guys. That's a little bit darker blue cat there. Ain't none of these fish been big, but hey, I'll take them. They might not be big, but they've been fun. So let's do like we always do with this one too. Let's let him go. He gone. Now let's get most of these rods baited back up and thrown back out. How about that? We might not have to drag after all. I done got enough for a video. We'll see what happens. I may drag a little bit, but I don't know. I may get out of here before I get some burnt and all the boats come out. Stick around though, let's see what else we can get into. Alright guys, we're hooked up again. This is on that rod up on the bank. This don't feel like a bad fish guys. This might be the biggest one of the morning. This feels like a good fish, that ain't no joke. This will probably be the last one of the morning too. Cause the daggum wind's really cranked up on me. He's decent. He's probably close to the biggest one.
There we go, guys. I don't know what, I think it's six or seven now. I, I don't know, I've lost count. But that's probably the biggest one of the morning so far. If not, he's close to it anyways. Ain't too bad of a fish. Yeah, guys, it's been a pretty good bite this morning. Like I said, spring is here, water's heating up. It's just a great time to be out on the water. If you can get a bait in front of their face, they're probably going to eat it right now. So, right now is a really good time to be on the water if you can get out there on it. Bank or boat, it don't matter. They're eating. I'm going to want to get this fish gone. I'm going to let it go. And I'm debating on whether or not to call it. Because the wind sure has picked up. He gone. Alright guys, we're hooked up again. This is going to be the last one. This daggone wind has really cranked. I apologize if there's wind noise. Yeah, guys, there we go. That's like fish eight, eight or so, I think, I don't know. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna call it. This This wind's just getting way too strong for my liking. It's hard to anchor fish in wind like this. That ain't a bad fish, though. It's another nice blue kit. Well, we're gonna do like we always do. He gone. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna get these rods in. I'm gonna call it. We've caught plenty enough fish for a video, so. I'm gonna get out of here while the getting's good, I guess. But I wanna, wanna thank each and every one of you. And as always, God bless and thanks for watching.